Hi, this is Charting Man Dan of TheChartGuys.com, home of technical analysis education. Click the link for a free week trial, no credit card required, and gain access to our multiple live broadcasts daily, community chat room, educational videos, nightly watch lists, and more. Invest in your education and future and join the community today. Hello, hope you had a good Friday looking at Amazon on the daily and weekly time frame. We were watching this channel very closely as it got tighter and tighter between the middle Bollinger Band support and the 10-day moving average resistance after we were coming off the all-time high. Signal number one for potential bear activity was the loss of the 10-day moving average support. And then signal number two occurred two days ago on Wednesday when we closed below that middle Bollinger Band with some weakness at the end of the day. From there, we saw a quick drop. Bulls did buy that dip, but today rejected again from the 10-day in the middle Bollinger Band. Big time pullback, breaking $700 psychological support. So once that middle Bollinger Band broke, 700 psychological support was our target. And if we continue to see weakness, we have support at 696.42 and 688.76. So the bears are in short-term control. The lower Bollinger Band acting as support. You can see the low of the day bouncing off of that. We're going to see these Bollinger Bands begin to level out and then descend. And that will create more room for for the downside if the bears stay strong. Look at this volume that definitely stands out twice the volume almost of yesterday for the bulls and obviously vast majority of that action for the bears today. Bearish MACD cross of 50 is close to occurring. So from here on out, we're looking at these lower highs that are being set. And as long as these short term 10 and 20 day moving averages stay resistance, we are going to continue to see a pullback. The weekly time frame confirmed the bearish reversal candlestick from last week. And we're going to be looking at the 10 week moving average support this coming week, which will be in the upper 680s and would not be surprised to see that tested increase in bearish volume compared to last week. And that 10 week appears to be where we are headed. If we can turn this 10 day and middle Bollinger back into support and break 722.56, which was the top of this little bounce attempt, then we'll be looking back at the all time highs. So we're not going to forget the overall trend is, is very bullish for Amazon coming off these all-time highs. We are looking for just normal healthy consolidation at this point, and we will see if it becomes something more than that if this 10-week support is lost. So I appreciate you watching and hope you have a wonderful weekend. Thanks for watching. The Chart Guys community has compiled trader tips from dozens of traders over the last year and put together a free ebook you can access by clicking the button and entering your email. Have a wonderful night.